two cars start moving from the same point. One travels south at 50 km per hour and the other travels west at 30 km per hour. At what rate is the distance between the cars increasing two hours later? So let's say this is the same point and one car is traveling west at 30 km per hour. So let's say this is 30 kph. And the other car, let's say this would be car A, and this one is car B, and this is traveling at 50 km per hour. So we are asked to get the rate of the distance between the cars increasing two hours later. So we need to get the derivative of this distance. Remember that distance is equal to speed times time. Therefore, after two hours, car A traveled 60 kilometers, or we have 30 times 2. And for car B, this would be 50 times 2. So we have 100 kilometers. So assigning variables, let's say this is x distance and 100 kilometers is y distance. 30 kilometers per hour would be the derivative of x with respect to time. And 50 kilometers per hour would be the derivative of y with respect to time. So let's say this distance would be z. So we need to get the derivative of this distance with respect to time. Let us solve for this distance if x is 60 and y is 100 by using Pythagorean theorem. So we have x squared plus y squared is equal to z squared. So by substitution, this would be 60 squared plus 100 squared is equal to z squared. This would be 3,600 plus 10,000 is equal to z squared. So we have 13,600 is equal to z squared. Getting the square root of both sides, we have the square root of 13,600. We can factor this. We have 400 times 34. So z distance is equal to 20 square root of 34 kilometers. Now, using implicit differentiation, we can now solve for dz dt. Let's perform implicit differentiation. So this would be 2x dx dt plus 2y dy dt is equal to 2z dz dt. Since all terms are divisible by 2, so we can divide all the terms by 2, giving us x dx dt plus y dy dt is equal to z dz dt. To get dz dt, we can divide both sides by z. So this would be x dx dt plus y dy dt all over z is equal to dz dt. So let us use this to identify the rate of the distance between the two cars. So we have x, that would be 60, dx dt would be 30, plus y is 100, dy is 50, all over we have 20 square root of 34. So this is our substitution. So this would be 1,800 plus 5,000 over 20 square root of 34, and that is equal to dz dt. So we have 6,800 over 20 square root of 34. 
Simplifying, 6,800 over 20 is 340 over square root of 34. Performing rationalization, we have 340 square root of 34 over 34. And simplifying 340 over 34, that would be 10 square root of 34. Or we can say that this would be approximately 58.31 kilometers per hour.